What's up everybody, welcome back to my laboratory where safety is number one priority and today we're going to put to the test kitchen gadgets. Let's see what I got today. For the first gadget we got here a carton holder. So we put the milk or juice, whatever you want, right inside of it. Boom, and look how much easier it is to lift it and grab it. If you don't have a carton holder, if you have smaller hands, it's kind of hard to hold it. Especially for the kids, it kind of slips out. I have huge hands, so for me it's no problem. I'll tell you what, if you put it inside of this carton holder, it's a lot easier to just grab it, hold it, open it. Super, super easy. Check this out. No problem. So much easier using this carton holder. This is such a simple gadget, but at the same time works so well. I'm definitely using this one all the time. Every time I need to replace juice or milk, I'll just take it out, the empty one, put a full one in. And as you can see, it does not fall out easily from there. Love it. For the next gadget, I got here pineapple slicer, but it's a style of an apple slicer. I've never seen a pineapple slicer like that before. So, let's see how it works. Got yourself a pineapple, then you're going to cut it, like usual, the top and the bottom of it. And then you take off the bottom of it, put it like this. Then there's a core right here. And we're gonna match it up with the core. And then we're just going to slice it. Oh, kinda went sideways a little bit. Actually, it's probably easier to slice it on a flat surface first. And to finish it off, then you bring this out and just push it all the way in. And check this out. These two pieces falls out like this. You got right here the shells. Boom. And right here the pineapple. And right here the core. Wow, that looks like a flower. You can just serve it like this. Amazing, that looks so good. That pineapple slicer was awesome, but I might got something even better. I put to the test this kind of design, but this one comes with a storage container and also a slicer. So let's see what this one does. Step one, we just cut it. Step two, we just have to crank it right into the core like this. And you don't want to even push it too hard, you just spin it slowly all the way down you see I'm not pushing it at all it just goes in by itself pull it up like this and that's what it's going to look like when you pull it out you see it's perfect cut out then we're going to push on this two and pull the handle out boom like this then we're going to grab this cup and put it upside down and let it drop like this into there boom then you're going to grab this part and put this out like this this is the core it doesn't taste good then once you're done you can close this side here firmly and then you can store it and it's going to last a lot longer in a storage but once you want to take it out and eat it you can take it out like this put this piece in Put this piece right inside of this, put it like that, and then we're going to slice it. There you go. I have to push them out and have a little bit of bigger plate, but it works pretty good, as you can see. And I have here another pineapple slicer. Let's see what this one is all about. Boom, wow, that one looks cool. All metal. We're gonna cut the bottom. Then we're going to drive this in, screw this in. And you see how this time I didn't cut the top. Once you cut it all the way, like you see it's not going anywhere anymore. So now I'm just gonna take it out. 
boom. Then cut out the top. And now all you have to do is just push these things out. You can either push it out or in the description it says you can cut it like this. Boom. And this piece comes out. I kind of have a hard time to keep it in the middle so I'll have to practice a little bit to figure out how to use this pineapple slicer. But still pretty cool design, never seen one like that before. For this gadget I got here guacalac, guacamole saver. Let's see what this thing is all about. If you love guacamole, you might want to get this gadget because you know if you open up guacamole, eat half of it and close it back up, it still after just few hours will turn like different color and does not look good. It probably goes bad quickly. Well, this side here pumps out all the oxygen so that way it does not turn any other color and stays fresh a lot longer. So let's open it up and see how it works. You might want to make your own guacamole or after you buy one, doesn't matter. So I have a half a jar of guacamole. If I lock it up, it will still will turn different color after 24 hours. So this is why this side here opens up, then you get this part and push it everything in. And you see how all the guacamole goes to the top. And you see, boom, there's guacamole pushed up all the way to the top. And then you close this, and there you go. Then you put away your guacamole. You take this out, so that way it doesn't push by itself. And check this out, all the guacamole got pushed up. So next time you want to get some guacamole, just open this up. Anyways, this is a genius idea, I love it. So once you're done, you can close it up. Maybe one complaint, I wish this top right here was a little bit more flat, so if you open it, so if you have this guacamole kind of liquidy, it might spill out to the sides. That's the only problem with that gadget, but overall, I love this design. For this gadget, I got here banana filler. Let's see what it's all about. They said here you can put some chocolate in there. So let's see how it works. You pull this one out, and take everything out. Then you put the banana inside here. Wow, that's a perfect banana. And then you squeeze it together like that. So that way you can pour it too into the banana. You know, bananas are soft, so it's pretty easy to pull it out. Check this out. And then you use this little red tape piece to pull out the banana. There you go. Then this is what our banana looks like. Got our chocolate, and then we're going to just stuff it with chocolate all the way. Look at that. Ooh. That's nice. Oh, that's all the way to the top. Now let's peel the banana and let's see what happens when I break it off. Boom. Wow, look at that. Oop, I knew it's gonna be messy, but that's awesome. Let me just do a taste test. Looks interesting, definitely a very unique way to eat the banana. Honestly, I thought it will be a lot harder to use. So it's actually a huge thumbs up for me because it's so simple kids can use it so easily love this gadget so this gadget i got here pretty cheap orange juice so it's like 16 to 20 dollars okay let's see if this gadget works we got an orange in half like this oh cool boom check this out that does so good actually and then you can just take this part out and take out all this extra stuff wow that did good and look you can do less pulp more pulp that's awesome
by the way you can just cover it up and wait till the all the orange juice will do up inside there so that's a really good look how much orange juice we got and it's fresh orange juice amazing for 16 bucks can't beat that well guys that's pretty much it let me know in comments below which gadget was your favorite honestly i love all the pineapple gadget and surprisingly this banana core and filler is actually pretty awesome never seen anything like that a really good idea a fun way to make a dessert and of course don't forget to thumbs up this video subscribe and i'll see you next time